hi loves and welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome my name is myra and today i'm going to be swatching the new bloomin on complete collection from not polish don't forget that if you shop with not polish you guys can use my discount code myra everything is linked down in the description box for you guys to see but yeah i just want to get started and show you the colors already because i'm super super excited i have not have not seen these colors yet so i'm very excited and i'm also using the acrylic brush from not polished in the number 12 and this first color is called grayed out um as always packaging 100 like they are super super secure and they also have that top like plastic um thing that it usually comes with so you can take it off when the acrylic is new i did take them off prior because this collection is pretty big and so i didn't want to like you know take a lot of time doing that um, but you're going to be able to see it in this next color right here which is called the mood and you guys know that I love their packaging, the red, and then that's the little thing I was talking about. I always forget what it's called, but anyway, um, I really love this collection. It's perfect for spring. It has 12 different um, shades. It's from like grays to nudes, yellows, pinks, blues, and greens. So like I said, perfect, perfect for spring. And they also have the matching gel and lacquer that you guys can purchase as well. This comes in a collection, like how I'm showing it to you here. Or you guys can buy the colors individually. If there's like a few that you specifically eyeball and you love, you can buy them individually. And like I said, they also come with the gel and lacquer. So next up is Actin Shady. Um, these are more like cool neutral colors and I really really love the way they look the nudes especially and the blues caught my eye but I'm gonna tell you that my all-time favorite color on here if you haven't guessed it and if you don't know what my favorite color is yellow the yellow in here is absolutely gorgeous that is the one color that I have used um, I did a what did i do i think it was a oh yeah a sculpted like nail application acrylic application video like i usually do on my instagram i did it using bees like that which is a yellow shade because my eyes went directly to it it is the only shade um yellow in this entire collection so i had to use it first and the others i kept um unopened so i can do this video so i think is this one naked truth i think it is i skipped past one but you know i love that these acrylics are not only two ounces which will last you a very long time i love when acrylics come in two ounces um not only that but they are perfect for any skin tone and i love that how versatile they are and how you know how pretty they are because they're just so pigmented and honestly, so buttery. Oh, here is Spring Affair. And I really love this peachy nude color. Um, like I said, there are, I think, like two tones that are very similar. They look similar in like this video. But honestly, they're not. They're, one of them is a little more peachy. And the other one is a little bit more, it's like warm. And then the other one isn't. I think it's these two colors right here. You can kind of see it on the camera how that top right color looks a little like yellowish as it's um, curing but it actually is a very nice like peachy color but this one right here is a cooler peach color so they are different when you look at them if you're a nail tech you understand because you're able to see the difference between colors even though some people can't see the difference but you know you're able to see them so this right here is the color that I'm talking about, the absolute perfect pastel yellow. It's called Bees Like That, and I am going to be doing a set very soon using this because it is perfect for spring. So I am ready to bring out these, you know, sets that I have in mind. I have so many sets in mind that I want to do. I have a lot of acrylics that are coming in that are you know perfect for spring and so not only will i be of course still uploading daily on my instagram but i want to be more in depth here on my youtube channel and so stay tuned for all of that if 
make sure to go follow me on my instagram so you guys can see colors i do show a lot of like you know upcoming new colors or new products and things like that and i was just so excited to swatch these i did also want to answer a few questions that i saw in some of my last few videos one of them is um here, let me read it. It says, just curious, is there a reason you opted out of filing? I feel like if you had filed the marble nail, it would have brought forward more of the green color. And yes, that is correct. Um, I did not file because I do the pop-off method. And so I completely skipped the filing process. I try to make my acrylic application and my nail art and all of that as clean as possible because I do not go in and hand file nor do I go in with the e-file. So I completely skip that step. If you see me doing that step, it usually means that I'm going to keep on those, like those nails on for like a day or a few days. Um, but when you see me skipping in that and not showing it, it's because I completely skipped it because that is a pop-off method and my nails will pop off if I go a little bit too harsh on the nails. So here is Tangled Orchids. Oh yeah, I just wanted to answer that question because um, I see that question a lot. A lot of people ask me if I do file. And some videos you can see that my nails aren't filed. Some you can't. Um, I just try to be as clean as possible, like I said, with my application and everything. So yeah, um, this color is super beautiful. And then these last few colors are like... This one is a very pretty lavender. I have yet to find a more perfect lavender than that one i it was extremely hard like since i started doing nails i had only found one lavender color that i really really loved and then i ran out and they stopped selling that color so i hadn't found one yet up until this collection so i'm super super excited of course i could make my own acrylic and things like that um but i tend to just want to order the color that it is already just so I don't have to mix colors and things like that. <laughs> so this one right here is Chasing Waterfalls. And I thought I was going crazy because at the bottom it says um, Chancing Waterfalls. But I looked on their website and it actually is Chasing Waterfalls. So I think it was just a typo. Um, but it is a very bold pastel blue with a very warm undertone. So, like I said, all of these colors are super, super different. Even though they are, like, in the same shade range, they are very different. Um, if you see them next to each other, you'll see the difference. This one is Keep It Cool, and it is a mint green color with a blue undertone. And it's just so, so pretty, this one, this minty color. And then the very, very last acrylic that I'm showing you from this collection is called Upsaged. It's a vibrant green with tiny specks of gold glitter. So it is super beautiful. And yeah, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I wanted to just do this quick um, swatching video. But of course, make sure to follow me on my Instagram because I will be uploading tutorials or watch me work, acrylic application videos using these amazing and beautiful colors. This is the newest collection from Not Polish, their Bloomin' On collection. And do not forget to use my discount code Myra. You guys will get um, money off of your entire order, whatever you get from their website. Everything is linked down in my description box. And if you guys have any questions, feel free to comment down below and I will answer it in my next video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.